right, so today we're going to learn how to use a pipetter. This is probably the most important tool you'll ever use in a biochemistry lab, but it's also really important in phys chem and analytical labs. There's different manufacturers that make them, but they all work with the same premise. Each pipetter has a range, and you do not want to go above or below that range because it's been calibrated to make sure that you're getting the right volumes. First step, you want to set your pipetter to the volume that you want to pipette. I'm going to pipette 800 microliters with a P1000. So here, so this little gauge here tells you what volume you're pipetting. The upper number shows you your upper range. So once you've set your volume, you want to get the correct tip. The blue top means blue tip. So you want to take your pipetter and firmly press down and give it one tap to make sure it's fully on, and then you're good to go. So when you go to the solution you want to pipette up, you want to stick your pipetter in the solution just barely while you put the very top down to the first stop. You'll feel it stop once, and then if you want to go down again, you'll feel a second stop. Always go down to the first stop. Put your pipetter straight in to your solution just below the top of the surface. Then you want to gently pipette up, evenly and slowly. Keep your thumb on top of the pipetter and then move your pipetter directly over to the next beaker you want to pipette your solution into. To dispense, you want to press down all the way firmly until the second stop and do this evenly. And then once you're done, you press this back button here into the tip waist and put your pipetter back. Make sure you never leave a pipetter horizontal when you have a used tip. Always dispense of your tip first, and then if you need to, you can set it horizontally. And that's how you use a pipe better.